world in front of us as we know it. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg has done something which, honestly, in my opinion, I expected to see out of Apple. Orion is probably going to be the next major platform after phones. Yes, that's right, everybody. Throw your phones in the garbage because they're done. That's old stuff. Listen, you're walking around with a phone, you're going to be a grandpa. That's what you're going to be considered, all right? Meta is the new new. It's the way you get that riz, all right? Tony Stark glasses are in the making. So, listen, guys. It, it's a pretty cool uh, situation that we have here with uh, Orion's glasses. It's essentially Meta's new augmented reality glasses, which he believes could become the next major computing platform after smartphones smartphones orion's glasses are described as the first ever full holographic ar glasses resulting from a decade of research and development you know what's funny is ai is going to cut all that research and development in half but um <laughs> moving forward yep. it uh, hopefully won't take a decade to figure stuff out anymore put stuff in glasses but zuckerberg envisions these glasses making computing more ambiguous natural and social aiming to eventually release a consumer friendly version so i want to open it up to the panel because i know we have lots of thoughts what do you think about walking around with glasses that are going to be identifying you on the street which are going to be filming you non-stop everything is going to be a camera out of everyone's eyes now um, I think this is even taking the next step from phones in our pocket, cameras in our pocket, to on our face. I think it's definitely coming next, but um, do you so. think population will adapt it or not? Um, I'm going to link a video into chat uh, that was posted on X about two Harvard, Harvard students showing how these glasses have made doxing simple. And it's almost yeah, entirely... Yeah, I watched that accurate. video. Yeah, yeah. It's crazy. so not every not every person they asked, "Are you this person with this job who lives in this area?" said yes, but almost every person did. In the video, they they showed six, seven different people. Random is in the street. Random is in the substation that they approached. The glasses gave them a quick scan, and it showed them LinkedIn profiles, Facebook profiles, and broke down all the data live in front of them. They then approached the stranger and asked if the data was correct. And I don't know if it was literally nine times out of ten, but nine times out of ten, go watch the video. It 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 was correct. It was eerily like accurate. And that yeah, we're living in an era of constant surveillance now. And it's not even just the state that can surveil you. Any old job with enough money to buy these bloody glasses can surveil you. Like that's that's a concern. That's a big concern for me. I don't know about anyone else, but I'm scared, frankly. <laughs> uh, I don't know why you're scared of the future, but uh... um. <laughs> well, I, I hate to tell you this, but they can do that already on PC. Correct. <laughs> yeah, a hundred percent. It's already no, no, no. The hold fact on. That someone can put it's... on glasses and do Listen. it anywhere they want. Listen. First and foremost, it's I mean, used it's for. Just, it's just... First and foremost, it's used for tracking and to identify, okay? That is for the government purpose. Now they're going to sell it to you. Do you understand? <laughs> they're going to profit off of that tech now. They're going to sell it to you, and you're going to do it yourself because you're going to look at your neighbor, and it's going to go, <laughs> it like, you're going to do it. You're going to do the job for him. We are all going to be wearing those cameras that people think are crazy in the UK. We're all going to be wearing them. But this is nothing new. The Of being exposed on camera and not know it and stuff, that came out with the Google Glasses. They called those people glass holes. Jeff was one of them. Um, <laughs> but uh, but it, it's, it's interesting tech. Now, listen, there it could be abused. There could be, uh, 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 like, privacy concerns. But... This type of stuff could be revolutionary for like somebody who's looking at gas mains underground. You can have augmented VR where you're walking around and can see where all the pipes are going and all that stuff without you actually digging. Like this kind of stuff could be really cool and revolutionary, but more than likely we're going to be spying on each other. <laughs> there you go. Hey, let me let me tell you something. If you are wearing those glasses and you got your palm ham out and there's a lady standing in front of you, you're going to get slapped, all right? And you're grabbing and moving your hands and doing movement with your fingers. Uh, no, seriously, um, 
seriously though, man, look, you come to Oakland wearing those glasses, you're gonna get those snatched off your face. You're gonna get robbed. People getting those glasses robbed, they come out here yeah, to but Oakland. You can identify the robbers before they come to you. Yeah. Well here's the thing. The glasses, <laughs> the glasses are thick and identify people live in the street. Who well, has a good credit score? Who has a job working as an accountant? He well, looks listen. fancy. How fancy actually is he? Well, let me just look through these glasses for a real sec. Then you've got all the information about what you have to realize you can do that on your tech, phone already though all this tech is going to end up on a lens on a lens what? not in the what? not what? in the actual bridges and the frames it's going to be what on the it? lens eventually and then it's going to be on UV your stuff? on the lens you put on your eye and then the it'll be you replacing your eye it's happening what it's coming the, what was the what was the ubisoft game with the hackers and they were running all over london this is some watchdog crap right here, dude. Fucking, but um, uh, you know what? I'm all for uh, you know, uh, upgrades and innovation. This is cool, but uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. Kind of, oh, kind of cringy. It's a little, it's a little cringy. It's a little, it's a little cringy. I think a little cringy, yeah. man. I think they solved the issue of laziness one step further. I think they were having issues with everyone having a camera in their pocket but not taking it out. Now everyone's going to be on camera all the time, always visualized. A pervert's always... dream. A per a pervert's <laughs> dream right here. These glasses right here. A pervert's dream. Are you telling me you can spot upskirt. another furry yeah, from a mile away? <laughs> A lot of upskirt shots gonna be uh, uploaded oh, no. to uh, porn Pornhub. Um, you know, uh, yeah, this is this but is the bad. Con another concern factor is who's making this? It's Meta. I mean, it's not even a government who's gonna have access first off to all of this footage. It's gonna be a random corporation who don't have the same responsibilities that that a government might have, even though a government would ignore half those responsibilities. But that's not the point, right? A, a random private company with random jaws looking at these videos are going to have access to feeds all around the world of people, I don't know, putting them on in the bedroom, walking around the trains. Like, it's... It, it, it's it's, uh, you know it's easier for? to buy from a private company when you're not doing it yourself. Well, yeah, well... What I'm getting at... What, what, what you're not even... Control? Oh, go ahead. Go ahead, SPG. Say, you're not even going to have to buy special glasses. They're going to be built into the fucking lens eventually. No, it's going to yeah, happen. No, it's just... Right now, the, the, we are the, about to be in such a... And we're already in an incredibly surveilled state, but it's just all these but, advancements but the, in the technology problem, just the, the problem so is more and more. Well, Privacy does you, not exist. <laughs> no, 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 but here's the thing, though. Wilson's got a point, though, that it's a private company. It's 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 Facebook. It's Meta. That we all know how well, how super secure they are as a company. Yeah, I mean, they're one of the most. Point. Yeah, yeah. They're they're one of the most. They're they're the biggest company in the world that promotes nothing but safety and security. Like I I trust everything with it. Says no one. Nobody buys that bullshit. Excuse my language on that one. But nobody's gonna believe that they are 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 your safety and security is gonna be built around all of this tech. What's going to happen is it's going to be a real life version of of the storyline on Watchdog Legions, and I, I'm not trying to tie it into purposefully into video games, but that's exactly what's going to happen. Or you're going to have the government's going to get involved and regulate everything, and they're going to dismantle it from within. Well, listen, everything is going to scan you eventually anyway. You're not going to have sales representatives anymore. You're going to walk in through the door. It's going to scan your face. And a, hey, a, hey. Virtual, a virtual salesman is going to pop no, up no, and no, go, no. hey, Rudigs, remember that last tie you bought? We have another one in purple. Oh, you're not here for no. ties. What do you and need, buddy? And you'll see it oh, all shit. on your lens. It'll yeah, be well, all well, the information I, hey, right hey, in front now, of you. Now, hear me out. I, I've been the <laughs> biggest naysayer on AI and all of that BS. But if they bring me a holographic 3D version of Jaws and some, and I can walk into the cafe 80s and get my Rudy's. order, based I'm on all your for social, it. based on your social score, we recommend this suit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And people now, are going to have gonna social use... scores oh, when you walk out there. You're going to be able to see, Correct. oh, so... how high is this person? Like, like uh, Wilson saying, credit scores um it, it'll be an interesting well, no, world no, no, no. to live now, in if, if that, i think if that, the main that, question that. is will there be a transition from the black brick in your pocket to whoa, something whoa, on your brick face in my pocket 
Excuse me? Do you think like, people <laughs> will Ray's, drop the Ray's phone for glasses? Right now, Ray's bricking it. <laughs> uh, I think those who can afford to will if the glasses are... Uh, are what is a dicky bow? What is a dicky bow, Phoenix? I don't even know what that is. Are you serious? Dicky bow. Are you serious? Oh, no, like a bow tie. <laughs> right? That's like yes. a bow tie. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I guess that's a, a British term. Yeah, yeah I think it's, it's a, a cockney like... slang thing, I think. Yeah. Um, no, I actually don't own any bow ties. I do own ties. You know what used to be my play was the skinny tie. The skinny hey, tie I think you'd look good in an ascot. You should Google that. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, let's...